It's been a long time, hasn't it, Jesse? Far too long. Indeed. I am also joined by Nomad, voice of Sun Wukong. Hey, gang! The animator for episode 10, and also reoccurring commentator, Brandon. Hi. And the audio editor of the finale of Ruby Abridged, and also the reason this video we're watching exists, J Chippers. That's too much praise. <laughs> yeah, do you want to... This is... Well, we're starting off these commentaries. We'll get to the finale later, but we're starting off these commentaries with this Goblin Slayer Abridged short. And do you want to explain the story behind this? Uh, if I remember correctly, it... We, I made a comment at our uh, a bridge panel that we did uh, at Komoricon mm -hmm. uh, a couple years back that you should you should use fitting music uh, for for certain a anime that you're uh, abridging. And the example you gave was don't use something like Lady Gaga for something like Goblin Slayer. <laughs> and I think I reached over, grabbed the microphone out of your hand, and was like, yes, you can. <laughs> <laughs> and that's where this came I, from. I was trying to be professional, but then I, after the panel, I'm like, wow. <laughs> I would totally do that, too. <laughs> and then you realize you were doing it with me, and I'm just like, professionalism? What is that? Is that, is that, is that like, a, like a food? No, it, it's a lovely accessory you buy, enjoy, and appreciate for a bit, and then throw it out the window. <laughs> <laughs> is that a Danimals? Yeah, that's more accurate. But, funny enough, uh, this is the second Goblin Slayer related thing that's been produced by a Bridge Brains member. Yes, uh, Bridge Brains. I'm part of the Bridge group, Bridge Brains, and they've also done a Goblin Slayer abridged, but mine is, uh, it's pretty different. Better? <laughs> no, it's, dif it's different. <laughs> Art is subjective. Yes. I would say better. <laughs> uh, so, I really, really wanted to get She Wolf Riley to do these commentaries with us. The problem is, they live in Australia, so it's like 9 a.m. for them right now. So, sadly, we couldn't get them. But they, they did amazing as Goblin Slayer, obviously, but also Goblin Slayer is like they love voicing goblin slayer so much and that makes me very happy i like their take on goblin slayer i imagine it was a ball and a biscuit recording that <laughs> my throat it killed my throat voicing the goblins <laughs> i even posted an outtake on twitter of me ending a recording and just me like turning away from the mic just going oh <laughs> That's how I felt uh, doing uh, voices for goblins in uh, in the Bridge Brains Goblin Slayer. Oh yeah! Oh, oh. wow! We're already at the end. Uh, here comes the Lady Gaga, <laughs> and it and I told you it fits. It fits <laughs> freakishly, uncomfortably so. Yes, it does. Solid editing on the timing. Yes. Yes, this will not be the only song during a fight scene that we'll have in these commentaries that is just like, why does this fit so well? I, I like that uh, every take of Goblin Slayer abridged, uh, every abridgment of Goblin Slayer just gives a different take on Goblin Slayer's insanity. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, and uh, uh, Dream of Serenity also did fantastic as Priestess. But I want you to know. Everybody did amazing. Everybody. Yeah, solid performances all around. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, but see, watch. <laughs> <laughs> damn it! Pop off, queen. <laughs> God damn it! Checkmate, J Chippers. Nice. It's like I ain't part of this shit. <laughs> you served me. <laughs> uh, nope, that's just the end. Good night, everybody. <laughs> yeah. So that was that was Goblin Slayer Bridge. That went really quick. I forgot how short that video was. <laughs> Probably because it was a one-shot literally planned after a convention j two months ago before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, also, uh, the fact that, um, I mean, you say it's a one-shot. I've already revealed this on Twitter, so I, I feel like I might as well say it now. That's getting a sequel. I'm currently in the process of making a Goblin Slayer abridged two-part. Part two. Hey, yo. A two-shot? Yes, and there will be another Lady Gaga song. I, oh my god. I'm making sure of that. Bad bad romance. <laughs> I was just gonna say that. <laughs>
<laughs> will it be uh, top? Will it be hold my hand from Top Gun Maverick? We really need to get some girl boss power in Goblin Slayer. I can. Mm, say that. Mm. <laughs> I, I second yeah. this notion of girl boss Goblin Slayer. All right, I'll do a three part. Oh, let's go. <laughs> let's go. We Just got it. A series at this point. We got it. It's Goblin a trilogy. Slayer can, uh, Goblin Slayer <laughs> can be like, he can be my wingman anytime, and there's no one there because he doesn't have friends. If you need help on goblin voices, I can do goblin too. <laughs> yeah, and I had to do them again for the part two, so like that was fun. Uh, like, because the goblins are just. <laughs> uh, all the actors did amazing. Uh, I edited it surprisingly fast, even though there were some motherfuckers of edits in this episode. The two that automatically come to mind are when Goblin Slayer is holding up the Danimals. That was really hard to do. Uh, <laughs> and I think the very end where the priestess kills the, the guild girl, which honestly is one of my favorite bits in the video. But the blood splatter on her face, that took a while. Yeah, I imagine. I just love that you included all these different fucking jokes. All just to lead up to one specific Lady Gaga joke. <laughs> I'm a stubborn motherfucker. You know this. <laughs> respect i admire respect. your perseverance you 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 told me <laughs> you did it out of spite